<laughs> hey Elvis, you know, Omar has her maths test today. Emily is so kind. He helped Omar with her studies. Sia, what's wrong with you? Don't you know gender of nouns and pronouns? You made so many mistakes, Sia. Oh, is that so? Can you help me with understanding gender? Sure, why not? Let's understand the gender of nouns first. This is a family. It has grandfather and grandmother. Father and mother. Uncle and aunt. Brother and sister. The grandfather, father, uncle and brother belong to the he group. All such nouns are of the masculine gender. The grandmother, mother, aunt and sister belong to the she group. All such nouns are of the feminine gender. Let us see some more examples. Emperor, Empress. Gentleman, lady. Actor, actress. Lion, lioness. Cock, hen. Bull, cow. All things belong to neutral gender. They are neither masculine nor feminine. For example, table, fan, toys, mountains, dam are all neutral in gender. Now let's understand the gender of pronouns. The pronouns I, me, you, we and us can be either masculine or feminine. The pronouns they and them can be masculine or feminine or neutral. For example, the boys had studied well for their exams. They scored good marks. The teacher praised them. Here, they and them resemble the boys and are of masculine gender. The girls had practiced well for their dance performance. They did it well, all applauded for them. Here, they and them resemble the girls and are of feminine gender. Baby saplings were planted by the kids. They were watered daily. The kids took good care of them. Here, they and them resemble the saplings and are of neutral gender. The pronoun it is used mostly with animals. For example, I take my dog to the park daily. It plays with me. Here, it belongs to the neutral gender. Oh, Elvis, you make things so easy. Thank you. If you like our videos, please do share and subscribe to our channel.